throwing that battle wore me out. Really? It looked to me like you just plain lost. Like Axel is like legitimately How dare you? fairly. Hitchy. You don't appreciate the nuances of an ungainly huh? effort. Oh hey bitch. Vexen. How could you be humbled by someone of such limited significance? You shame the organization. <sighs> How can we help you, Vexen? It's not very often we see you topside. I came to lend you a hand. You obviously believe this Sora has much potential, but I remain unconvinced he is truly worth such coddling. I think an experiment would show if he really is of any value to us. <laughs> well, here we go again. It's just an excuse so you can carry out your little experiments, that's all. I'm a scientist. Experiments are what I do. Yes. You have Whatever. very you expressive what you eyes. Want. But you know, I think testing Sora is just a cover for testing your valet. Valet? He's the product of pure research. What he actually is, is a toy. Hmm. You should just learn to be quiet. Anyway, since you came all this way, you're gonna need this. A humble gift to my elder. I hope you use it to put on a very good show for us. Oh. Is it off? What's your past? We don't have time! They've got Naminé! We gotta rescue her! Whew. Sora sure does seem like he's upset. You'd be too. He just remembered a friend, but found out she's in trouble. Good point. I guess if we heard that the king was in danger, we would be pretty upset about that, too. So, new friends of yours is a friend of ours. Let's go help Naminé. Come on, sir, we gotta rescue Naminé from the bad guy. Meh, see? Meh. Now, well... Do we want to go? Atlantica, 100 Acre Wood, Hollow Bastion, or Neverland. So, Peter Pan, Little Mermaid, Winnie the Pooh, or Final Fantasy slash uh, Sleeping Beauty and... Beauty and the Beast. It's kind of like a weird mashup. Let's go to the middle. I need to mess around in OBS and more stuff. Well, I've got some stuff on the floor. It's not that bad, it's mainly my desk is a mess, and then there's power cables which are a mess. But the floor is actually relatively clear. Where are we now? The floor is kind of unsteady. I can hear the ocean too. I know, we must be inside a ship. Really? What game? Well, we better find a way out. But which way do we go? Well, who are you? Oh, she's flashing her panties. For a second there, I thought Jiminy was gonna try and ride her. <laughs> Great, now I've got that energy in my head, which is just amazing. Just Jiminy Cricket. Flying, a fucking, <laughs> a fucking Tinkerbell. Hey hippo, how's it going? I was actually looking up pictures of James Franco to try and like. I was gonna swap out my face cam for a picture of. Uh, James Franco and see 
how long it would take for people to notice. Um, but like, I couldn't find any pictures where it, I actually thought he looked kind of like me. All your sides are clean, the floor is hoovered, all your clothes are either in the water or in the wash, and all your games are neatly all. Uh, good job cleaning. I need to clean later because I've got a viewing of the flat tomorrow. I do need to organise my games again because now I've got the three consoles. So, yeah, I need to organise those in a good way. <sighs> Maybe she's trying to help us. Or just flash us her panties. Looks like you're right. No, yeah, I know I won't find him, a picture of him wearing it. Just... Oh, <clears throat> you're turning into a furry. You and Martian should talk. <clears throat> Please don't talk about furry shit on here. Like, I, sexual freedom, great thing. Great thing. However, I don't really want people to know. Fair enough, Clash. Now this one is going to be an interesting like yeah. level design for me, because... Yeah, exactly. My headphone popped out. Uno momento. Well, Xbox Live, it's £40 for the year. But yeah, fair enough. That's, if you've only got, like, let's say, £50, go for that. I haven't even got Xbox Because I just don't play Fire. online. Fire. I don't really play any of the consoles online. PSN just makes more sense because I've got PlayStation 3, PlayStation 4 now. When I was playing Destiny, you actually did not some shit. Yeah. Right. Yes, sir. Furry isn't just sexual. I know it's not. However, um, a lot of it is. At least if you talk about it on the internet, a lot of it's sexual. I have furry friends who are furry in the non sexual sense. No, I am anything. Fair enough, Clash. Um, I pay for it by then. Yeah. It's just that I've really, I switched over to PC. Donald. Pretty much two years ago. But... Yeah. Well, you can. It's. I'd just rather you didn't talk about it too much, just because eventually it would end up sexual, whether you mean it to or not, or knowing you. It would probably still end up sexual. But, you know, Fire. I'm just saying. If you start talking about it, people are going to take it, you know, that yeah. way, regardless of whether like, that's how you meant it. Damn. Oh, yeah. And now we're back to the point of the game that I actually probably will enjoy. Just going. Can I even. Oh, yeah. This game just got about a million percent better. You tried reformatting, like, the hardware and stuff. Oh. 
GG Goofy. G fucking G. Ooh. I needed one of those. I need like five of them. I find it. Oh. False bounty. That doesn't sound good. That does not sound good at all. Okay, what are you? A one or up? False bounty. Room where only one treasure chest is real. While I have a chance to use number two cards, I can only use one. Well, actually, I should use A1. Let's try the, one of these, the black fungi. I'm probably going to regret this. Do that every time. Hello. We're an interestingly laid out room. difficult because I was expecting them to need more magic because I know that you can just wait for them to come out of that metal form but they also you can also use great things about living away from home for uni. Don't get yeah. to go to bed. Yeah, yeah. Do occasionally get told to shut the fuck up by my flat. That's why if I keep streaming more than like 20 minutes from now, which I plan to, I uh, will have to be a little bit quiet. So shh. I do plan on getting through at least yeah. one uh, world though tonight. That's not my plan. Oh. Hey Nade, how's it going man? I think we should let's get that to seven hundred and then next we're gonna get our health up because Right, what's this door? Wink. No. My head bubble. My head bubble. I got an A star in maths, ICT, and biology. And then got a B. Got an A or a B in chemistry. Oh. 
holy shit, look at the cards I've got. I have so many of these that I may as well just use some of them up. Uh, so let's see what's behind door number one. I think I got a B in it. B or a C. Yeah. Um. Yeah. No, I got like a B in C in history, C in friend. Chest. Amazing chest ahead. Amazing chest ahead? No. no. Stick him in the hole. Thunder. Pretty sure I could have gotten that from the normal chest. You have two. door closed. What? According to the minimum, it's still closed. Weird. And deal multiple blows on an enemy. Ew. You spank when men and women. Well, good for you. the room starting to look the same. Maybe we're just going in circles. Some help she is. That's right, just show us your panties. I think you might have ruffled her feathers, Donald. Tink, what are you doing? You weren't supposed to bring the pirates with you. Now he's showing us his panties. Ugh. Stay back, pirates. Well, this will be the last fight you have. What's the big idea? We're not pirates. We're only here because... Um, why are we here? Huh? How am I supposed to know, Donald? Goofy, what do you think? Gosh, beats me. Okay, okay, I understand. Sora, Donald, and Goofy, right? Guess if you were real pirates, you wouldn't get lost on your own ship. Plus, you dressed funny. Coming from the guy in tights. There you go again! Wait, so if you thought we were pirates, this must be a pirate ship. That's right, we're trapped inside the Jolly Roger, ship of the old codfish, Captain. If we're trapped, that means you are too. Me? Don't be silly. No one can capture Peter Pan. I'm just laying low until the time to spring my plan and touch all those little kids. I mean, uh, what plan is that? The pirates kidnapped my friend Wendy. She's got to be somewhere on this ship. I didn't expect there to be so many pirates on watch, though. I sent Tink to look for a way around, but all she found was you. Bet I know what Tink had in mind. If we all make a big enough racket, we can distract the pirates. Here, look at my panties. I'm gonna fly around your head. Or she must have read her mind. No, I just read the text on her panties. But how about it? Let's work together, at least until we get a boat deck. Well, why not? Of course, I could save Wendy myself if I wanted to, but you guys look like you'd be stuck without me. Don't you have any manners?
I I think Annabelle likes Peter Pan. Oh wait, no, this. Yeah, we're back here. So it's. I've, never, I've not been up that. That's not the one I want to go to yet. So I want to. Can't access that room. Okay, so we need to go right and then on. Then women. Sorry. Uh, I'm gonna take a break after this room. Maybe a little snack. Mm-hmm. Uh, there's actually several paths of evolution where evolution reached a certain point and then just went, Nope, we're done. What else can we do here? Crabs, for example. Uh, I don't remember if they've been around since dinosaur time. But they've been been around for a bloody long time, and there's three different paths of evolution um, where crabs evolved. So by that I mean that there's three different like main types of crab, which all evolved through different paths. So it wasn't like one animal evolved, evolved, evolved crab. It was like three separate things evolved independently of each other. Uh, okay, Annabelle, have a good night. Talk to you tomorrow. There she is. Peter, Peter Pan. Wendy, are you all right? I've come to rescue from you with my three new lost boys. Touch them at night. Come on, let's go off this leaky old top and do some exploring. Ha ha, we'll never grow up. I'll make sure of it. Listen, Peter, I've got something to tell you. Book had his way to with me. I want to go home to London. I need reconstructive surgery. <laughs> what are you talking about? Why do you want to do that? You'd have to turn into a grown-up. Besides, going on adventures is a lot more fun. Bend over. If you go back to London, we'll have to leave the nursery. We'll grow up and we'll never see each other again. I know, Peter, but I still want to go home. Came to wreck you. Don't care if you ever see me again. No, you don't understand. Suit yourself. And while you're at it, rescue yourself. I'm leaving. Hey, wait a minute. There he goes. Peter, I'm carrying your child. Not very thoughtful, is he? What do we do now? Hey, I've got an idea. Why don't we think of something once we get up on deck? That doesn't make any sense, I think. Well, there's still trouble waiting outside. Wendy, you stay here. We'll try to create a distraction. All right. Be careful. Maybe if you change your mind, Pete will come back and come save you. Because you're a woman, and you need saving. And this isn't sexist at all. Blue cup. Eh? I do have a fucking lot of these that I'm very rarely gonna use. So I gotta be quiet. I gotta be quiet. Woo, we finally made it out. There you are, you rascals. I'll teach you to play stowaway on my ship. 
Bender. I'm about to hook you. Friends of Peter Pan, I'll wager. Are we his friends? He sure didn't seem to think so. Yeah, the way he took off like that, he ditched Wendy. I'm not finished talking yet. How dare you ignore me and plop back on civilized brats. You're in cahoots with Peter Pan, no doubt. If you say so. Either way, you're gonna let us off this ship. Wendy's coming with us. Think again, you scallywags. Looks one step ahead of you. How the fuck did they manage that? Wendy? Any trouble and Wendy takes a long walk off the plane. You wouldn't. Believe me, I'd rather not. After all, I need Wendy to bait that blasted Peter Pan. Then I'll just have to take the bait, you old codfish. Eh? Peter, you came back. Here I am, Hope. It's me. It's a brat. Today is the day you pay for taking my hand. Uh oh. Oh, <laughs> Defying physics, Disney style. You've made a fool of me for the last time, Pam. Cleave you to the brisket. Standing on the plank, just cut the bit of rope. Let gravity do the work. Another man in tights. Don't worry, I'm just gonna thrust into the man in tights. Repeatedly. Oh fuck. That's nearly not. with the combat system now. That face. <laughs> when a keyblade goes up your ass.
thanks, Peter, we owe you one. He did nothing the entire fight. Well, at first I thought I'd let you handle it, but it really looked like you needed help. Really? But hey, you three did pretty good, though. It was the Keyblade that killed him. I'm pretty sure I shoved it up his ass. Wendy, about London. Are you sure you won't change your mind? Peter, I'm sorry, but I really want to go home. I'm about to stab a bitch. I was afraid of that. Everyone grows up, and grown-ups always forget. First you'll forget what it feels like to be young, and then you'll forget about me. How about you? How can you say such a thing, Peter? I'll never, ever forget about you. Sure, that's what you think now. But when you try to remember me, the memories will be all gone. You forget, little by little, one memory at a time. Once you've grown up, there won't be a single memory left. Except that time I touched you behind the leeches. Don't say that. Memories, even important ones, don't come back to us whenever we want them to. But that doesn't mean the memories are gone. More like, like they're sleeping. So when the right thing comes along and wakes the memory up, we can remember it. The memories engraved in our hearts never go away. I'm sure of it. It's right, Peter. Never, huh? It's funny. I thought everyone who left Neverland forgot about everything. But I have a feeling you guys might be different. Okay, Thor, if you say we'll meet again, then I believe you. Oh, Peter. Let's go, Wendy. London is waiting. Later, Lens. Have a good night. Get your pants about to go fuck a bitch. Goodbye, Sora. I'll be waiting to see what you look like, all grown up. Then, I can fuck you even harder. Booty call! This must be a gift from Peter, because Tinkerbell isn't able to make her thought to herself. Maybe he's not such a thoughtless guy after all. Ow. A Moogle? Another gift from Peter? Nope, this Moogle just couldn't fly. What's the big idea? Tinkerbell. Ooh. No, you're... Riku. Riku! What are you doing here? Not happy to see me? Let me know if I'm getting in the way. You know, of something that's more important. Huh? I didn't mean that. <laughs> Spare the excuses. I bet that you had all but forgotten about me. Are you crazy? Come on! I came all this way looking for you! But you're not anymore, right? Now it's only... Naminé that you're looking for. You don't care about me, just like you never cared. At all. About her feelings. Naminé's? <laughs> I knew it. Never even gave it a thought, did you? Just cause you wanna see Naminé. Sorry. Doesn't go both ways. Tell you the truth, Naminé doesn't even want to look at your face. Why not? You should ask your memories. Why Naminé disappeared from the islands. Remember that, and you'd know. Did I... Did I do something? Is it my fault? Riku. Go home, Sora. I'll care for Naminé. Anyone who goes near her... ...goes through me! What's... what's wrong with you? We're supposed to be friends! Please, Sora. 
Since when have you ever cared about me? Naminé's not the only one who's sick of looking at you. So am I! <laughs> Riku, stop it! They both have different voice actors, and it's fucking weird. As in, I mean, they have different voice actors from the first game. Obviously, it was gonna happen, but it's still fucking weird. Yeah. I have a feeling. Sonic played. Back off. A bit OP. Ouch. Oh, he's You bastard. Hurry! Come on! Gotcha! Oh, God damn it. Wasted. Use a little bit. You bastard. Get ready. Heal. You gotta be kidding. Oh. This is it. That's done. And it's not right in. I'm just pulling out all the fucking combos. You're working pretty well. That was easy. That was like really easy. I swear, Sonic Blade in this game. Is kind of insane. Arrow. Mm. Mm. CP is never about. Really? That's fucking it. Rico, please wait. I just want to stick it in your butt. We'd better go after Riku. No shit. Gorish, what could have happened to make Riku talk like that? Somebody touched his butt. To top it off, Princess Ariel has disappeared. King Triton's words sick. He must leave his chambers. <laughs>